In this video, we're going to explore actions in Photoshop to try to make ourselves more productive when working in Photoshop. First, you're going to go to Windows and check off Actions. When you do, the Action pane will pop up. I'm going to close the default actions, expand the pane so I can see more of it. Now I'm going to hit the Create a New Set button and give it a name. This name should pertain to whatever it is, whatever action you're creating. And then to create a new action, you're going to hit the Create New Action button. Before getting started, you're going to, going to want to create a snapshot of your original image. So I went to the History panel, and I'm going to click Create a New Snapshot, and there you have it. And you'll notice that Photoshop is recording all of the actions that I'm taking. If there's an action you don't want, you can simply remove it. So you've noticed that it's recorded that I made a snapshot. So now maybe I'm going to go to do image, image size. I'm going to change this to percent and change it to 200%. And you notice that it's recorded that step and added it to my action. Once you've done this, if you want to go back to the history panel, you can go back and forth between the original snapshot and your new image to test what it looks like. If you want to run this on another um, image, you need to make sure you hit stop first because it's going to keep recording your actions. As you see, it's recorded all my actions, so I'll need to throw those away. But you're going to hit stop first, open up another image, and all you'll have to do is hit play, and it will make these changes to that image as well. And again, I recommend creating a snapshot of your original image so that you can go back and forth. Anything you need to throw away, you can just drag down to the trash can.